Hello, my name is uh, Patrick Jamison. I'm the product manager for Iris for Health. And what I'd like to show you very briefly is a demo of a new capability in Iris for Health that helps manage fire APIs. This is using the InterSystems API Management Portal. And we're not going to have time to go into all aspects of it, but I'm going to show you one very cool feature of that portal, and that is the development portal. Going into that portal, one can load API definitions, and this can make it very easy to use uh, Fire with Iris for Health's Fire server. What I'm going to show you now is how easy it is to use because we're going to have a API catalog of fire resources that you can then use for your own testing and development. It will create uh, different language uh, specific fire requests and basically inform you about what you can do with uh, fire. So let me give you just an example of how we can learn something about the practitioner resource. I'm going to select that through the development portal and you here see definitions of various uh, API requests that you can make. First we could post a patient for example and this would show us the fields that we would need to instantiate that. But let's say I would just want to retrieve a practitioner. Very easily we could use this portal and I'm going to just test, a, uh, test one endpoint on it. So I'm going to just test number one, and we've preloaded this with a number of patients. And I'm going to make this API call. And you see what we get back. We get a server response of 200, meaning that we have a valid request. And we can see down here the actual return from that request. We see the bundle of, uh, that was returned from the request. What's nice is that we can also see example requests in a number of languages like JavaScript, Shell, Python, or Ruby that you could then cut and paste and put in your own code. We could also see up here, and I will uh, demo this in our longer version, different ways in which you can parameterize a request and get different uh, bundles of patients back. But the key message is this, for people that are new to Fire, the development portal makes it easy to issue requests and get back different resources without understanding a lot about Fire. And it allows you to then have code snippets that you could put into your own client languages to make the same requests of our Fire server. Thanks a lot.